So, welcome back to my living room floor. I wanted to do a demo, though, here of the 128 and its awesome dual monitor display. So we have, on our left, the 80-column display, and then on the right, our 40-column. And you'll notice the menu on our left-hand side here. It's only occupying half of our screen. Uh, reason being is this is effectively a Commodore 64 program that they just split some of the assets on. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, the two screens do work together, and, and I find that to be fun. So let's take a look at the SID player. I think that has the best demo here. Let me get this loaded. Uh, there's a bunch of SID files here, and I wish I knew more about SID files. I'm not an expert. I will warn you now. But, um, yeah, it's got a fun little set. And we're going to take a look at times. Let's get this. Looking right. Okay. Okay. Oh, let's get that volume up, huh? So how fun is that? We've got the lyrics going on the left, and we can see the keyboard on the right, which shows us which notes are being played, and, and to see them working both together, I think is super fun, even though, yes, okay, they are just taking the text that would normally be under the keyboard and placing it on the left-hand side of the monitor, but nevertheless, I, I think it's fun to imagine how you could create a fun karaoke system or something around around something like this, so... Yeah, I missed opportunity on the 128, which is kind of the whole story on that thing. But um, yeah, this is a fun, cool use. And I just really enjoy that 80 column display and the colors that it spits out. Uh, all very pleasing to me. Um, so yeah, let's back out. I'll be honest, that was the best part. Uh, so <laughs> you are not going to be blamed for tuning out at this point. But uh, I want to look at a couple more things since we got this going. Let's quit. And there is a really simple demo in this thing. We'll play it. It's okay. It's okay. Sure, I'm really selling you on this. Um, it's interesting. They have blended a basic program with some of the SID stuff. So, again, you can imagine how there would be some text on one screen and some animations on another and you could do a lot of fun stuff with that. Enhanced SID Player, a complete music system for the Commodore 128. That's the demo. It's the Danton notes. That's the <laughs> it's the main charm of that, I guess. And you know, it's uh, telling you about all the wonders, envelopes, and waveforms. Oh, here's the best part: crescendo, eighty-column glory. Uh, satisfying ending. So that's the gist of it. That's the most interesting parts, I think. Uh, there's a SID editor that's also interesting. I have no idea how to use it. But yeah, fun program. I, I will look forward to exploring it. really looks like you can dig into the notes and oh, do some... Do some wonderful compositions, perhaps. So, 
I'll see if we can get that times file going again, but on our editor. Oh, Be nice if I spelled it right. All right, for the times, uh, words by Ken Fuller, music by, uh, let's see, Harry Bratt. Okay, uh, copyright 1986. So, cool. Let's see if we can figure this menu out. I know Sing Along definitely is all about that karaoke. We'll see. It might just play the song. Yeah. Same deal as before, except we don't get the keyboard, so well, not as fun, in my opinion. Okay. One last thing I think I'm going to demo. Let's take this disc out. Put this mystery disc in. Hmm, what could this be? I think it's about this moment I regret not having the fast load card in. Oh well. The joys of Commodore loading. It's really part of the experience. Let's see what we got. fun crack screen. Back in better than ever, ever, ever. All right. Hey, it's the Commodore 64 SID player. So you'll notice the rainbow background in the SID player logo. Uh, that's why that was split before. I find that very interesting. So they just, it looks like, took this blue and white and black screen and the rainbow part of the program just kind of hung out on our 40 column. I don't know. I find that very interesting in itself. So at any rate, uh, I'm going to learn me a SID player program and figure that out and, and become a little more proficient in it. Very much looking forward to seeing what the demo scene is out there doing. But at any rate, I'm going to make some more 128 demos and I appreciate you checking out this one.